Why is it that so many Jewish homes across the world have a picture of the Lubavitcher Rebbe, the Jewish leader of the 21st century, hanging in their homes? Massive hangings, paintings, pictures blown up across their houses. Is this admiration for a human, is it normal? Is it okay? We're gonna go check out a Jewish home that has the Rebbe picture on the wall. Come. Hello? It's Espresso Parsha. Here's an analogy. Take a mirror. We use it to make sure we look good. We want to check ourselves out, make sure we look presentable, our, our hair is done nice, our makeup, our beard is waxed and brushed to perfection. We see how we look at the present moment. When we look at the rubber picture, we don't see what we are at the moment. We see a better version of ourselves, what we could become. That's because every generation, the Jewish leader has a soul that encompasses all our souls. The Rebbe's soul is our soul, just in a perfected state. Physically, we don't need a push to grow. We learn how to roll, we learn how to crawl, we learn how to walk, we learn how to run, it's natural. But spiritually, mentally, emotionally, we, a lot of the time, need that push, that encouragement to become better, to grow. Not because you're lacking, but because you have so much more potential inside that you could still unleash. The Rebbe was an influencer. Today, influencers care about the more likes, the more follows, the more famous, the more power. But the Rebbe was an influencer of a different kind. You weren't just a number. You weren't just a fan. The Rebbe was interested in you becoming an influencer as well. As Rabbi Jonathan Sachs said, you saw your reflection in the Rebbe's eyes and suddenly you were just so much bigger than you thought you were. Danny, come say this line. <gasps> you just said it really well when we were talking about this, so. The Rebbe stressed that your deed can change someone's life. That's amazing. That brings enormous potential to a human being. It gives you a purpose. And your deed can bring the world to the era of Mashiach as well. It's in your hands. And that's why Jews and non-Jews have a picture of the Rebbe hanging on their wall. So now, unleash your potential. Chaim from Espresso. Partial.